Due to renovations at Jones AT&T Stadium, Texas Tech football hosted their annual spring game here at Grande Communications Stadium in front of over 10,000 fans. I thought they did a pretty good job. Um, wanted to play clean with not, not a ton of penalties. We had a few, but for the most part, there, there was high effort, high energy, and protected the football, which was exciting to see. The truth is, defensively, we probably weren't ready for a spring game yet. Just as, as far as installation, learning new, learning new defense, learning new schemes, terminology, all that. And you know, Coach King and uh, Coach Morris and the offense is, you know, year three. So uh, the kids, the kids, they played hard. They flew around, um, made some good plays, made some bad plays. We're, we're, you know, we're in transition right now. We, we're, uh, we're a work in progress. But I'm, I wasn't disappointed. But I've been telling them that all spring. I mean, I, they, they, these. These young men, they practice hard, they play hard, they, they come in and they try to learn and study and, uh, you know, we'll just keep grinding. They've picked it up quick. Coach Gibbs done a tremendous job working with them and, and uh, I'm sure they're going to continue to progress. Pat played good. I mean, Pat's a playmaker. Pat's going to do what he does. So it's always, it's always, uh, you know, it's always, it's always fun watching him, watching him play. Just doing his thing, you know, moving around, making plays. And he had a couple throws, decisions he'd like to have back, but uh, I've been very impressed with the way he's handled. And he'll go to baseball one day, come to football, I and mean, that, that's hard on an 18-year-old kid, especially one with a 4.0. So uh, he's really done well, and uh, he'll continue to get better. Patrick Mahomes finished 12 of 16 for 169 yards and two touchdowns. Texas Tech will wrap up spring practice in the next two weeks. For Texas Tech TV, I'm Jordan Warren.